Ah, shit. YouTube, YouTube, what's up, baby? I got good news and bad news, man. Good news and bad news. She told free calls and shit. Keep calling. Toll free. All right, so look. You want the good news or the bad news first? I think we'll go with the good news. All right, good news is made it back home safe, as y'all can see, uh, after the national championship game. We won that, too. That's some more good news. Uh, feel me back home, back, back to work. Uh, shit, the bad news though, the bad news, man. Y'all already know for real, but I'm just gonna tell y'all anyways, man. The knee, this motherfucker is swollen all over again, bro. It's probably something serious, man. I don't know if it keeps swelling up like that, bro. It might be something serious, like, cause literally it took me. The last time it swelled up like this, it took like at least three, three, four months to go down. You feel me? I was still squatting and shit. Not heavy. I couldn't ever go heavy. Still, I just was able to start going heavy again. And after this football game, well, right before the football game, it started messing up again. I had one real heavy day. I completed it. And then the knee started aching again, man. Like, So I really don't know what's next, man. What's next for Boom? Like. As far as powerlifting, as far as football, I just got, you know, some things to think about. Gotta sit down, you feel me? And just uh, do my little analysis, man. Risk, the little risk analysis, man. Is it worth it, you feel me? Like, moving forward, what's worth it, you feel me? As far as my health and, and, and working out and getting bigger and stronger. You know, that's my goal. And that's always my goal. That's my ultimate goal. So, we already know for the next few weeks I'm gonna be taking it easy on this knee again. See if it go down. I hope it do, man. Just, just pray for a speedy recovery or whatnot. You know, and if, if it don't get any better, man, I'm just gonna suck it up and then go get it checked out, see what they talking about, man. Get an MRI or whatnot, but. It's not like no unbearable pain or nothing. It's just like it just keeps swelling up and get fluid in there, and it's just a fat ass knee. You feel me? But uh, yeah. So as we know, I ain't about to be hitting legs today because I just did that yesterday. Some leg accessories. Uh, I'm about to hit back, back again, man. It's frustrating not being able to hit legs how I want to. I used to hit legs three times a week, man. Before my knee start messing up. I like hitting legs, you feel me? It get me turned, get me right. I feel like legs increase all the strength to everything else. Uh, but yeah, I got some deadlifts today. Don't know if I'm be able to go heavy, how my coach got on the thing for uh, for my program or not. Gotta see how the knee feeling. But right now, I'm probably gonna start off with some uh, back accessories. And then after that, I might head to the back and see, and see how them deadlifts feel. I'm probably gonna end it off with the deadlifts. Yeah, so about to go catch me a little pump and see how them deadlifts feel. Every back day starts off with pull-ups. That two days after the game, bro, whole body feel crash. You feel me? We're gonna make it through this workout though. No stressing, no complaining. After I hit these little uh, pump or whatnot, if I ain't feeling too good, man, and the deadlifts can't go today, I'ma roll them over to the next day, man. Deadlift Tuesday is supposed to be every Tuesday, but if the body ain't where it's supposed to be or where it need to be, we're gonna have to wait to some recovery kick in, you feel me? I was on vacation, I wasn't eating right how I was supposed to. Gotta get back on my meal prep, let the body recover, get my protein in me, you feel me? Cause right now, the way I'm feeling right now, I ain't even warmed up yet, but the way I'm feeling right now, it's over with, no deadlifts. Uh, yup. <clears throat> Uh-huh. Yes, sir. 
I don't want to speak too early, but I feel like uh, five of these might be good for us. Set three. Fifty reps on the pull-ups. Two more sets. <clears throat> Last set. really don't like put too much pressure on the chest. <laughs> but it's cool. Gotta get those chest supported ones in as well. Mm -hmm. Easy work. Let's go boom. We're gonna do one arm at a time. out the way now we're gonna do a double arm for the last set see how many we get Next machine. We're definitely gonna go up on weight. Isolate those lats. Get good squeezes. Yeah. 
Ah, there we go. Back pump looking like. Yes, sir. Oh shit. Oh that knee. What the hell? That motherfucker just buckled on me. Lats are going through it right now. I'm fucking them up. Let's go, Lats. Bro. <clears throat> <clears throat> sets it is man make sure you do five sets feel me you want them wings increase them sets increase them reps you feel me lock in do some isolation work tap in with that lat squeeze that motherfucker so it can grow feel me yep. isolated lat pull Let's get it you're gonna do 15 reps each arm Set after this one right here, and we're gonna take off the flannel. See what the back pump looking like. Oh. 
Time to check out this back pump, see what we're working with. Hair probably in the way.